I'll come back and today's little teensy tiny teeny weeny build will be this one which is 71745 Lloyd's Jungle Chopper Bike I uh, forgot I had this one I just was looking for a small build because I'm not really in it and I'm hoping a small build will get me going um, and it was sat there on the shelf and it's a while since I've done Ninjago so it seemed like a good idea so it's basically just a little bike and it comes with three minifigures so you've got the Island Naya Nia, the Island Lloyd don't say Lloyd, don't say Lloyd, the Island Lloyd and then what's he called? He's called the Rumble Keeper so I have to admit they are my favourite bad guys, the Ninjago Island range bad guys I absolutely love to little pieces, I think they're really cute, really fun design I mean, what? It's near. It is near, is it? Look at the same again Oh. You really? In, in the video again, that he, he called her Nia. That's what I'm telling you, that's, that's that. Nice who said Nia. 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 Thanks for that. Um, you get one of the little coin things. So it has. 183 pieces it retails at 17.99 that's about 10p a piece that's breaking oh I'm a crap job of that that's rattling about in there that's weird Surely there should be two of them. Oh yeah, there is. There's the other one. Odd. So two bags of Ricky goodness. Got the fin bit for the top of the bike. A big tyre. Little sticker leaflet. And the book of destruction. Start off building Lloyd and the Rumble Keeper. You don't want to say Rumble Tom, did you know? Doesn't look too heinous a build. As I expected, quite a few Technicy type bits and bobs in. Just purely because it's a vehicle, you always get Technicy bits and bobs. And that's how he looks completed. There's obviously a bit of fannying about you can do with it. We'll wait and see. Gives you an ad in the back there for the other ones in the range. Catamaran battle. Still haven't taken the plunge on that. I can't tell what the others are from here. That's the island one, which is incredible. The jungle dragon, which we love. And this little bike. And your little kit list at the back. And as per usual, we've got a feedback form. So, what do we think? It's only going to be sort of half an hour, I would have thought. Might take me longer because I'm really not in it. But we will wait and see. So I'm going to go away and have a little bit of a build and see how it all works out so hopefully i'll be back shortly and let you know what we think there we go we've got him built so i think we will start with the figures first of all so you've got island naya there in a blue ninja outfit I've be honest, I don't think I've got many varying her actual ninja outfit. I've got quite a few of the water one. Um, it is a double-sided face. So you've got smiley head. In fact, you can't see it because of a neckerchief. Let's just spin her head around so you can see the other head. 
the other fairy season. And that's just like a gently neutral expression. It's a really nicely detailed print, which is what you expect with a Ninjago. So I've got the print on the back, but I can't bother taking the uh, pauldron off. So you just have to take my word for it. Well, get your hair on, lass. There we go. So that's the and Nia. Nia, Nia, whatever. And then, of course, we've got Lloyd. Again, very similar detailed front print. And of course, he's got back print as well under his equipment. Two faces, so you've got the angry <sighs> face, and then if we spin around again, you've good, just got a fairly neutral expression. I like that the uh, Island Lloyd has a little bit of the uh, old war paint going on there. I do like the uh, molded hair piece for that one with the uh, bandana wrapped round. And then one little bad guy, which is the Rumble Keeper. And this is why I love this these particular villains. Just look how detailed that torso print is. And on the back as well. And I like the fact it's almost electrified with the print on the back of the head. And then his... Uh, aggressive little face there and of course he's got his little pre-printed shield and his spear and of course they're well tooled up with swords and then you've got the actual little bike <laughs> itself it's not great at standing on its own it sort of does i would say is this sail i thought it was going to be plastic it's not it's almost fabric but it's sort of weirdly fuzzy feeling very unpleasant to touch you can see the little stickers on the sides just to add that nice little bit of detailing I do like <coughs> that they're different size wheels looks a bit different come on stand up uh, I just want to stand up properly. I'll keep me, I'll keep me uh, hand on it. You can angle the sail piece. So it's just on one Technic pin. So you can, you can tip it down. You can basically do what you want with that sail. However you fancy having it, which I quite like. The whole piece with the sail on does come off. So you don't need to use the bike with it on. And it does actually balance when I do that. You swine. You swine of a machine. There we go. Pop it back on. You turn it upside down. You can see you've got these like moulded pieces for the exhaust. One on each side. Particular, it's little details like that that I enjoy on things like this. And because of the way the front wheel attaches it does actually sort of almost create a suspension because you've got these weird rubberized pieces i think they're like a silicon rather than rubber yeah not my favorites again it's a texture thing yeah i'm fully aware i'm weird but i don't care so it gives you that little bit of bounce which i think is a nice touch and it's a nice way to achieve that small front wheel they got the little tusks I don't know why we've gone with the tusks but we have so little guys in shot I'm gonna hold that in place because it keeps dropping over so there we go that's the Lloyd's Jungle Chopper Bike set 71745 183 pieces and retails in the UK for 17.99. Total build time 30 minutes. That's all. It's a nice quick build and it is fairly rugged. So it'd be uh definitely one that works well as a toy. Not uh 
particularly on the fragile side, which is always nice. Right, well, boing, 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 boing. Lovely. So thank you very much for watching this video. I do hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day, and I'll see you again very soon. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.